I want to try to make this quick, but I've got three points I want to make. Number one, in a land of equality, no one is special. If you keep pointing at people and talking about their color or I identify, I identify as this and that and the other, I identify as a black woman, I identify as a white man, I identify as this, you're the racist. You're saying that you're better because of your color. You're better because of your heritage. I identify as a human and as an American citizen. That's it. You add any other labels to those things, that makes you an elitist. It makes you a supremacist. It makes you the racist. That's point number one. Number two, if you want to build a better way of being, then you start acting the better way. You don't sit there and act like they did in the past, which is exactly what they're doing right now. They're sitting there and saying, oh, let's bring back racism. So let's all talk about it and make sure that we're identifying everybody based on their sex or their color or their ideology, doesn't matter. You're a supremacist. If you keep sitting there and doing this and, and pointing at everything and then, oh, especially when you love to blame things on this and that and the other, you're the supremacist. You're supposed to learn from history so you don't repeat it. Guess what? Your racism is repeating out of your mouth right now. You have proven yourself as a racist by sitting there and constantly labeling people by their race or by their sex or by their ideology that makes you the supremacist makes you the nazi okay number three the democrats are the party of racism and the kkk they invented it there was no party switch okay this isn't star trek where they flip-flopped in the universe and now the opposite is the opposite no never happened never happened okay what happened was is that their racism against black people wasn't popular anymore, okay? So they reinvented the KKK. They call it Antifa. Instead of white hoods, they wear black masks. But they still go after who? The people who protect minorities. Minority of color, minority of sex, minority of ideology. That's what they go after. They want the popular vote in the election, not the one that protects the minority. No, they want to be able to gang up with their big group and force the little guy to do what they say. That is the Democrat Party. Number two, and, and just to kind of end this off, um, you don't get to push the KKK off on GOP or somebody else, okay? When you guys are out there, when Hillary was out there sucking face practically, with Senator Byrd, the well-known member of the KKK. Yeah. When Biden was the guy who gave the eulogy when Byrd finally died. Oh, yeah. You want to tell me that the KKK isn't alive and well today in the Democrat Party? No. Your leaders were hugging and kissing on the guy. Okay? You don't get to shove your trash on someone else because it's not popular anymore. It's your trash. Clean it up. Own it. Own it. Because that's what you're doing. 